today's video I am going to evaluate a problem from complex integration. See here we have to evaluate integral 0 to 1 plus i x squared minus i y into dz along the paths y is equal to x and y is equal to x square. So in this video what is given we have to evaluate integral 0 to 1 plus i this is x square minus i y into dz. As you know that we have z is equal to x plus i y and what will be dz derivative with respect to x is dx plus i times of this is dy see first of all i am going to evaluate the integral along the path y is equal to x so this is a solution number one so this is solution number one and it is along see here along y is equal to x and see here what is y is equal to x so y is equal to x is nothing but the straight line which is passing through origin and having a slope 45 degrees or pi by 4 and this is x axis uh, whereas this is y axis see here x is equal to y it is a straight line so this is of the form y is equal to mx plus c where c is 0 m is equal to 1 so here slope is equal to 1 tan theta is equal to 1 therefore theta is equal to 45 degrees so see here so this is the point b 1 comma 1 so now i have to evaluate the integral using this ob line so along xy dy will be see here the dy is equal to dx now our integral is nothing but integral 0 to 1 plus i this is x square minus i y into dz see here this is z plane so now i am transforming in terms of x y plane that is x axis 0 comma 0 here and this point is nothing but 1 comma 1 so this is 1 comma 1 so this is x square minus i times of so in place of y i am writing x since x is equal to y and now see here what is dz dz is nothing but dx plus i into dy so dx plus i into dy now i am substituting in place of dy as dx see here i am transforming each and everything in terms of x that is x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1 so if you observe this one the coordinates of x are 0 to 1 and this will be x square minus i x into this is dx plus i times of in place of dy i am writing dx and now see so this is x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1 so this will be x square minus i x and if i take dx common this is 1 plus i into dx See, this will be 1 plus i is a constant value and this is 0 to 1. So, this is x square minus i x into dx. And now, see here, now I am going to integrate with respect to x. So, integration with respect to x. So, this can be written as, so this is 1 plus i is a constant. So, with respect to x integration, x square will be x cube by 3 minus i times so of for x this is x square by 2 between the limits x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1. So this is x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1. Now if I substitute the values then see what happens this is 1 plus i times of this is 1 by 3 minus i times of this is 1 by 2 upper limit minus lower limit x is equal to 0 so this will be 1 plus i times of this is 1 plus 3 minus i by 2 so the value here is 1 plus i into 1 by 3 minus i by 2 so this is along oa this is uh, according to according to the line y is equal to x therefore our integral that is 0 to 1 plus i this is x square minus i by dz is equal to 1 plus i times of this is 1 by 3 minus i by 2 so this is how we have to solve and our second path is along see here the second path is along y is equal to x square see now i am going to solve along the path 
solution 2 this is a solution 2 along the path y is equal to x square see always remember when there is x square so it will be of a cup shape this is a parabola and see this is origin 0 comma 0 so this value is 0 comma 0 and this is y axis this is x axis and this is y is equal to x square and this point is uh, c point is 1 comma 1 and now it is we have to evaluate this integral using y is equal to x square so if y is equal to x square what will be dy dy will be 2x into this is dx now what is our integral from the question so using this what is our integral value that is integral integral 0 to that is 0 to 1 plus i x square minus i y dz so x square minus i y into dz now i have to transform this so this is a z plane and now if i transform this will be 0 comma 0 to 1 comma 1 this value is x square minus i y times of in place of dz i am writing dx plus i times of dy and see if i multiply so or else if i substitute so i i have to take a line integration now i have to transform this in terms of x or in terms of y now i am writing in place of y as x square in place of dy as 2x dx see what happens here so the x limits are from 0 to 1 so x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1 this is x square minus i times of what is y here so y is nothing but x square and see so this value is dx plus i times of what is the value of dy this is 2x into dx this is 2x into dx now if i multiply if i multiply in terms of x then see what happens so this will be integral 0 to 1 x is equal to 0 to 1 so this is x square minus i into x square so this is one bracket and this value is dx plus this is 2xi into dx so this is 2xi so this value is i into dx now see here so the value here is 0 to 1 so if i take x square common this will be 1 minus i and see here this is 1 plus 2xi into dx and see this is 1 minus i times of 0 to 1 this is x square into 1 plus 2xi into dx so the value here is 1 minus i see here if i multiply if i send this x square inside this will be x square plus 2x cube i into dx and see the value here will be 1 minus i times of the integration for x square is x cube by 3 plus 2 times of this is x power 4 by 4 into i between the limits here the x limits are from x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1 now i am going to substitute the values that is 1 minus i times of this is 1 plus 3 plus 2 by 4 into i so if i cancel the value will be 1 minus i into 1 plus 3 plus 1 by 2i so if i cancel this for two times therefore our given integral so which integral it is so from the question the integral integral value is 0 to 1 plus i x square see here this is 0 to 1 plus i x square minus i y into dz is equal to the value here is 1 minus i times of this is 1 plus 3 plus i by 2 along the path y is equal to x square the parabola parabola according to y is equal to x square this is the answer and see let me explain you for one more time see here this is the question from complex integrals integration so first of all we have to evaluate this integral along the path x is equal to y as you know that x is equal to y is nothing but a straight line which is passing through origin and making an angle 45 degrees so z is is equal to x plus i y and dz is equal to dx plus i into dy so along x y 
if I integrate, so if I make a derivative, dy is equal to dz. So, the given integral is 0 to 1 plus i x square minus i by into dz. In place of dz, I wrote dx plus d dx plus i into dy. So, I made a transformation as it is a uh, single integral, line integral. So, I have to either transform into x axis or uh, y axis. So, in place of y, I wrote x and in place of dx, I wrote dy. In place of dy, I wrote dx. So, after calculating, I got the value as 1 plus i times of 1 by 3 minus i by 2. And now, See here, according to the second uh, question, we have to evaluate the integral along the path y is equal to x square. So, y is equal to x square. If it is square on x, then it will be in the form of a cup shape. If it is square on y, so it will be C, capital C. So, this is the shape you, which you have to keep in mind. And see, y is equal to x square and dy is equal to 2x into dx. So, in place of y, I wrote x square and in place of dy, I wrote 2x dx. And see, and after calculating each and every step and taking common x square, this is 1 minus i and if I took dx common, this will be 1 plus 2xi. So, after multiplying and integrating and uh, the limits are x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 1 and this is the answer. This is how we have to solve along the paths x is equal to y as well as uh, y is equal to x square parabola on the line and thank you so much and hope you can do by your own thank you so much